when you have a form, you, what you can do is come down to the bottom and hit the plus sign. And that's going to create a new tab. So now I have sheet 5. And I'll put in here equals. And I come back to the form responses tab. And I click on cell. Well, it says A2 when I click on that one because it's blocking it. But I can edit it and say A1. So it says form responses A1. So go get what's on sheet form responses in cell A1 and put it back. So when I push enter, that shows me the timestamp. So I'm going to do that again. I put equals. And then I go to the form responses tab. And then if I click on B1, it's going to put whatever is in cell B1 onto this new tab. So what I can actually do is if I grab the corner, so if you'll notice uh, when you click on a cell in the bottom right hand corner is this like little box. And as you hover over it, it changes to a plus sign. And then I'm just going to pull to the right. It's going to copy. And then I'm going to pull that down and just go all the way down. And so what it's going to do is it's going to copy in all the information from the first tab to the second tab. So understand that it will uh, just reference back to it. So if I change it on the form responses tab, it would change on this sheet. Um, but if you double click on any cell, it doesn't say the word male or female in this particular case. Notice it says it is whatever is in form responses C8. But if I wanted to change that and say, oh, I really wanted that to be a male, I can actually overwrite it. So you'll not notice I've overwritten that, that it now says male, and I can change this one to yes instead of no, and I can change that one to maybe because I'm replacing, I'm replacing the formula. So what it doesn't do is it does not change it on the form responses tab. On the form responses tab, it still has the original information. Um, but what it allows me to do when I do it this way is I can change and manipulate some of the information. I can delete some rows, delete. Um, I can insert a column, and I can just really mess this up and make it the way that I want to without destroying the original data. So that I can always go back to the original data, click on the tab, duplicate it, and mess with the, with the duplicate, or do whatever I want with it. So um, I like to leave the form responses page alone and work with copies or where I'm referencing another sheet.